So what I want to talk to you guys about today might have one of the most highest potential for gains this summer. Welcome to Everything Currency. This is a show where we talk about everything crypto and mo. I'm your host Jay and today I want to talk to you guys about one of my favorite tokens that I've been talking about on this channel since it was at around three cents and today we're going to talk about the origin trail token and something that they have coming up called the parachain auction and a new token they're going to be releasing called O. So if you're excited about that, like the video, subscribe to the channel. If you're not subscribed to the channel, and let's just get right into it. So right now, looking at the track price, so it's at 60 cents right now, up 9%. So the track price has been getting beat up for like the last six months, you know, and the all-time high for this token was 350. Man, I just remember... Uh, you know about six months ago when track was hitting three dollars and we was doing the Birdman money hands But hey, I have no doubt in my mind that track is gonna hit the all-time high I still think track should be in the top 100 just if track gets to uh, the where V chain is as far as market cap is concerned We could see some crazy astronomical numbers for the price of track. So um, this is not financial advice, but that's just what what I think you know what I'm saying so what is origin trail so you can go check out some of my other videos on origin trail I'm not gonna go over that too much but it is the world's first decentralized knowledge graph so if you don't know what a knowledge graph is definitely do some research into knowledge graph so just exploring these cryptocurrencies can make you like a lot smarter of a person because you know you can just learn things like what is a knowledge graph i didn't know what a knowledge graph was i didn't know that google uses a knowledge graph to make a lot of their money and to do a lot of their marketing and stuff like that now we have a decentralized knowledge graph so we have something that google uses and we're taking that and we're putting it into a web3 form and making it decentralized so that is pretty dope already you know just from that aspect of it so if you want me to explain more about the track token in detail like a deep dive just let me know in the comment box and you know we can go ahead and talk about that but what i want to talk to you guys about today is um the origin trail parachain that they're going to be doing on top of polka dot and the crowd loan that's going to be coming up so this is the website right here to the origin trail parachain it says bringing real world assets to polka dot so it says by harnessing the power of the origin trail decentralized knowledge graph origin trail parachain extends discoverability verifiability and greater value for interconnected web3 assets to polka dot so definitely come to the website read the white paper but going down a little bit just going over it a little bit for you so bringing real world assets into web3 use origin trail to turn real world assets like cars food luxury items house art and other web 3 into web 3 native assets so this is kind of like the concept that I was talking about with nfts like when you can have like your cars registration as an nft so this is like something like that you can see right here it says supercharging the metaverse ensure verif verifiability of nfts so that's definitely um Part of it and they do have like some of the best partnerships that i've seen in crypto especially with bsi parity walmart and some of these people scan these are big companies all the big companies in the united states use some of these brands that they're partnering with so it is pretty dope right there um coming down it says the og parachain incentivizes the use of the dkg so when you have something like a decentralized knowledge graph you need people who have this knowledge to stake their assets in order for this whole thing to work so you need to incentivize them in some way so this is where the origin trail ecosystem is kind of coming together so it says origin trail ecosystem two networks two network layers two tokens so the origin trail parachain it says origin trail dkg adoption incentives so you're basically encouraging people to use the track token through giving them the um otp token if they stake and if they participate in governance and they got to use this for gas trees for gas fees and smart contracts on the parachain the track token is going to be used for publishing and updating the assets um it's going to be used for the collateral for um some of the nodes i mean for the the central it's damn a little too excited let me slow down 
<laughs> the track token is used for the nodes, of course, on the knowledge graph and for staking. So OTP and track each serve a core purpose within the origin trail ecosystem. Track drives the creation of Web3 assets and then OTP incentivizes the creation of the use of those assets. So it's basically, you know, a system that just goes around a circle. So get rewarded for your parachain auction. So if you don't know how the dot auctions work, the parachain auctions work, they go like this. When a team or a project or company, whatever, whoever, it could be me, could be you, could be Elon Musk. If we wanted to do a parachain on polka dot we would have to do what's called a crowd loan basically where people are gonna stake their dot tokens and then they'll get rewarded with the token of the parachain so this has already been done with a bunch of parachains already some of the more notable ones are like moonbeam that's one that I was excited about um, Akala and these tokens have done pretty well in the past so if you know about parachains then yeah you know then you probably already know about this but if you don't know about parachains let me know because it'll take me a whole separate video to actually describe um, what a parachain is and exactly how they work but to participate and to get these tokens all you have to do is stake some dot tokens and then you'll get rewarded 20 OTP for each dot staked and then you can get higher rewards by having um, you know strategic partnerships early birds um, and then if you use like referral codes like I'll have my referral code if you use that you'll get a 5% bonus on your rewards or whatever so the cool thing about it in my opinion is you stake your dot in order to get these tokens you don't have to use your dot to buy these tokens so after a certain period of time each pair of chain has a different period of time whenever they release their tokens you'll get your tokens back so basically it's like kind of getting these tokens for it's pretty basically your reward for staking these tokens because you can stake your dot somewhere else and get a percentage on it but if you want to participate in the otp and try to get some of these tokens and and you're excited about the track ecosystem like i am then you this is a cool way to get some tokens where you don't have to buy them when they come out on the open market so i will put a link in the description in the in the description for the parachain it is a referral link if you don't want to use my referral code you can just erase it when you sign up no problem there but I encourage you guys to look at it this is not financial advice what you do with your funds is your responsibility make sure everything that you do is legal in your jurisdiction and all that good stuff um, and yeah so let me know what you guys think about the video let me know if you would like me to dive deeper in any of these concepts the parachain or origin trail token itself I made a lot of videos on track in the past you can just go to my channel and, and look up origin trail or track and you can find those so like the video subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribe to the channel think positive and positive things will happen till next time r.i.p crypto roots peace